Hello everyone, I hope you're all having a lovely day. In this following tutorial, I'm going to show you on how to download assets from the Steam Workshop so that way you can use it inside of Wadudo. So let's go ahead and get started. So what you're going to do in Wadudo is you're going to click on the paw button right here. Then click on Steam Workshop. And then, um, as you can see, I have stuff subscribed here. And then, of course, if you want to publish your own, uh, your own blueprints or assets into the Steam Workshop, this is where you can actually do it. Or you could just do it in Steam directly, basically. Um, otherwise, though, what you're going to then do, you're just going to click uh, here on subscribe, download on Steam. And then basically the community uh, tab will pop up for Waterdo basically. And then um, pretty much you can choose whichever file that, you know, whichever assets you want to download basically. Um, you could just, you know, check around basically, see which is what you like. So let's say for instance, I want this environment just for an example. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this environment. Then what you're going to do is click on the subscribe button. Also, it is very important to do double check, um, also in case you don't know how to speak Mandarin um, or Japanese or anything, depending on the language presented to you. Uh, this is Mandarin though. Uh, but basically, if by any chance you don't understand the language, you can use Deep L by the way. But otherwise, please make sure you read the description. As some people, um, you know, some people who post their works here, they may require crediting, which as you can see up here, they require credits. So credits um, to the person here who have made this asset. And basically, uh, what you're going to do is click on the subscribe button. What this will do is that it will download the um, it will download the asset that is subscribed into the Wadudo program basically, and then pretty much as you can see, it is installed here. And then what we're going to do uh, for at least my case though, I can be able to go into environment. I can go over here, click on source, and then click on this little uh, thing here. Have this enabled, and as you can see, there is a whole environment it's very bright for my case uh but i'm gonna go ahead and turn it off though but pretty much though uh if you ever want to download stuff from the steam workshop and stuff that's how you can do it and also if you want to post your own works into the steam workshop of course and again there is a steam workshop button here and yeah i hope that this tutorial helps you out and i'll see you guys next time okay bye bye